wonderful to be here in Silicon Valley and to be talking to you. Tell us all about it. When I moved back from the Silicon Valley to India in 2002, yeah. Nandan and I came together to create something called the E-Governments Foundation, an NGO. E-Governments Foundation. E-Governments Foundation to work on urban governance through a suite of software products. It's like an ERP for municipalities, to run municipalities. Right. And that sort of led us uh, to the other project because we were dealing with birth certificates and so on. Uh, the idea of the other project was uh, Indians did not have a national ID, a recognized national ID. No, it was all department based. Yes. The PDS food department gave yes. you a card for the, yes. and some NREG have, would have its own sort of book and so on and so forth. Yes. And PAN number was used for income tax and so yes. on. But we didn't have a platform which was just ID that can be used for everything. Absolutely. So, uh, so a lot of people, there were a lot of uh, problems. If a person from Bihar came to be a taxi driver, for instance, in Delhi, his ration card wouldn't work in Delhi. Yeah say, hey, yeah. it works in your village, but not here, yeah. and so on. There were all these problems. They were not portable across the country. And I think it's a giant leap. Absolutely. It was a giant leap. So the idea was, let's give a common identity, yeah. but let's also make it unique. That means let's ensure that one person get can only one ID. Yeah. So that one person doesn't go off, take five people's rice, yes. or five people's LPG gas cylinders yes. and so on. Right? So it is important that the, the resource capture problem is saw, uh, uh, sorted out. Wonderful, wonderful to talk to you and uh, look forward to working with folks here in the Silicon Valley who will work with us to help us on the 10-bed IC.